Good morning. Um, I've had a previous video on this um, organic soup. And that was for adults. Somebody just recently requested for baby. And I had to go and do research to know what and what to uh, use for baby. So we need something mild. Actually, the baby is less than three months old. So for now, it just occurred to me that I should put it into a video. For now, we've just, we are just pounding the soap, actually means the Ghana black soap and Nigerian black soap with um, foaming agents I'll give you an idea of what the foaming agent is and I just added milk that is all that is is, being, that is in this mixture now so we will continue from here that type to pound and mix them together today was baby organic soap making day Actually. it's coming out where we've not started I mean, pound, pound, pound. We added the uh, shea butter. Ushi. Shea butter is in this mixture now. One of my viewers kept calling and asking for soap for a baby. So I had to go back and research and know what and what would be good for baby skin since baby's skin is tender. We are about to add glycerin to the mixture. Yeah. And we omitted a lot of ingredients that would have ordinarily ordinarily used for the adult organic soap. Stress patients, Please as that. long as she's within okay. the four walls of your care, you still owe her that. That somebody go and stay by her side. I say, hey, between all of us got up. <laughs> so we got it that today. Oh yeah, add coconut oil, one and a half teaspoon. What is that? Hi guys. How have you been? Um, cut, cut, cut. We're adding the coconut oil now. You can also use jojoba oil, but this coconut oil that is accessible to us. One and a half teaspoons. Oh, I feel I've done almost two. Okay. Time for almond oil. One teaspoon. You know, this measurement depends on the quantity of soap you're using. Of so for now. Could be half teaspoon. It's not half, it's one. It's really so, or you can call it organic. Properly, properly, and cut it. <laughs> Sorry, we added honey. What else we add? Palm oil. Palm oil and honey. More one uh, teaspoon each. This is one teaspoon of camel. We are adding it. Submitting castor oil. We are adding it right now. One spoon. It's one spoon. Now, my time is see. Sorry, she just quickly want to add the turmeric in it. Although I try to keep my organic soap purely natural, so we have everything here that we need to add to the mix powdered milk. So our scope is complete, it's just a pound and package now. So we packed it in this uh, container. Those will last baby a while, you know, babies they don't use much soap. This can last up to two months for the baby. Then we also made soap for ourselves. We use the opportunity to make soap for ourselves, and we can also sell. You can see this is a bit darker. We added some other ingredients that we originally did not add to baby soap. If you want organic soap, you can always contact me, and I'm always encouraged when I'm being prompted by people to do that go through my videos and they want me to help them out in one or two ways um, so you can also try it at home from the video I hope you have learned something so i want to especially thank my kids for helping me pound out pound the pounding of the soap easy that made the pounding of the soap easy my son my daughter they took turns in pounding the soap it was really not an easy job even when our visitors were like wow this job is not easy I want to thank Mrs. Freemount for the hair. She did. I had to. I was inspired to make the video with this hair. She revamped it. Although I wanted to uh, do it myself, but I knew she would do a better job, which she actually did. Then again, I want to thank um, Lady V for encouraging me and inspiring me to do my soap again. I've been too lazy to do one, and I also want to appreciate all my audience. God bless you richly. Happy election day tomorrow. Vote wisely. Bye. See you in my next video. Hello guys. 
happy happy new year happy no 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 happy anything <laughs> just start again